Hello, welcome to my second F1 race of this channel. Uh, Droid 2, I'm, I'm hoping that's the right one. But yes, welcome to second race. I am in a Force India. I am at the Hungaro Ring. And I hope, at least, that we get a good race. Uh, it's my first race of the night. So I'll be lucky if I do on the first race. But hey, just a quick channel update. I'm not a daily uploader, if you, as you've probably noticed, but I have college work to do and I have other stuff to do. Um, mostly, I make music, actually. The intro music was made by me. If you want to check it out, I'll leave some music links down in the description. But enough about my music and what I'm hoping to do. We're here for a race. Let's get out on track. Well then, here we are on the circuit. I've got a Brazilian in front of me. I've got a German there as well. They're both in cage rooms. We have five lights, and off we go. Right then, I've got I've got a fairly decent start actually. I mean, it's quite. I mean, I've used no curves as well, so that's not bad at all. I'm keeping up with them now. Oh, everyone else has gone the outside. I'm going to throw it down the inside and see. It. Oh my God! This is just a Spanish Marussia has just gone. He's just, he has no brakes apparently. But, in all that, I got up to second, so that's good. Uh, and I've been, no. Been hit in the back. That hasn't happened to me for a while. That's just disappointing. And I've been taken down to P5. I've got the two Brazilians ahead of me. One of them says, one in the Caterham. Coming to the blind corner. I hate this corner. And, oh, Jesus. Oh, my Lord. So, Brazilians took each other out. The Spanish guy still can't find his brakes. And I've moved up into P3 in all that carnage. Now coming up to the second sector, into the second chicane, I've got an American in a tall Russo in front of me and he, he seems to have, he doesn't know where the track is, he's gone wide uh, and he's hit me in the back, that's that's useful, thank you. Although it didn't affect me that much, so it's not too bad and that is a horrible corner. Ugh. Yeah, good, good. That's, a, that's, that's a valid corner cutting warning as I come into the final sector. Black Digger 74 is 1 point, pretty much 7 seconds ahead of me hopefully I can catch him and win the race it's it's not been a bad first lap it's all been a bit hectic but that's what we want to see really is what makes an interesting video I can't help but notice that Pata Libre 25 is, only, is less than a second behind me so even if I catch up to the car ahead there's no guarantee I'll win the race because the, uh, that guy's all on my tail here Still getting a bit tense. I'm not really catching up to the car ahead either, which is a bit disappointing. Oh no, he's gone wide of that corner. And he's allowed me to gain about half a second on him, at least there. And so we're coming up into the second sector. Now, I hate, I really do hate this corner. Because the apex is blind, you can't see it. And I've gone wide. But on the contrary, I really love this corner. It's, it's just so flowing. Just roll through it nicely. Through the chicane. And I've overshot it a little bit. Right, after catching up to that German, he's he's and he's gone wide a bit there, and he seems to have a little bit of difficulty keeping his car on the circuit. In fact, he's going all over the shop here. I had to swerve to avoid him, and well, I I couldn't accelerate going into the third sector there. That would have been a spin out for the both of us. And this has become a three-horse race for the win here. It's uh, nothing much has changed since this time last lap, and I've been slightly in the back, but not much has changed. Now then. Come into the final lap. I've got the Spanish guy right on my tail. I've slightly stood on the curb. I've got a German right ahead of me. It's all gonna go down to the wire here if it stays like it is. You you can have a guess if you want to who's gonna win the race. You can see at the end of the video if you're right. German's cut the corner. Pata Libre has got the fastest lap. That's not good. He's right behind me, and he does seem. I mean, brake issues aside, he does seem to have some pace about him. So I'll be lucky if I win this race without him overtaking me. Coming up here we go for the third time to the blind corner. And I'm catching up on the caterham. And he's broken very early. I've hit him in the back. And it's it's all going a bit off. 
And I tell you, look at that. I'm right in his gearbox. I tell you what, if this, if, if I was into the barrier, I could upload this as a, as, oh, God, the Spanish Marussia has just gone panning faster. So you must have a penalty for that. And he's all over the shop. And uh, Caterham and I have both got the corner. I've hit the Marussia. And now I've hit the Caterham. Oh, it's all getting a bit competitive now. As I was saying, this could, this could be an Inter Barrier Under Pressure episode if I was him. But I'm not. Uh, and um, I'm a second down on the last lap. And Marussia's gone wide. It's taken him up the inside. And he's out of the run. And the Caterham's all over the shop. I'm going around his outside now. But he's throwing it back down the inside. And if I'm going to have, if I'm going to win this race, I'm going to have to throw it back down the inside going into this final quarter, which I have done. I've got half barricades left to deploy. I've overtaken him and I've done it. I have won the race. And I tell you what, that final sector there was insane absolutely mad the second lap I admit was a little dull but oh someone oh we've lost connection before he just went past us oh I don't know but that was madness that last sector let's see what my engineer has to say great job great job what a win do you know what this time I agree with him I, I, I didn't drive the best, to be honest. I should have overtaken that cater and probably during the second lap, but it's certainly made for a good video. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Check out my music if you want. Have a lovely day. See you next time.